With the current AI technology, is it possible to 100x software developer productivity? I think the tools we have are really good, but what's lacking is the autonomous orchestration. Today's AI tools are so good and they keep getting better. Recently, a lot of the frustrations I had have been solved. There's now autonomous mode, YOLO mode, agentic mode, whatever you wanna call it, command line calling. This didn't really exist six months ago. Can we 100x developer productivity with the current AI tools? A very hard question to even start answering. I knew it would take a lot of time, so I set a 100 day challenge to becoming a 100x engineer. When I first started this, I wanted to just make videos and give tips to help other people reach that 100x, and I thought it could be done just using the current tools out of the box. I was using Ada in three different tabs, going at 3x, and I thought even one Ada is like boosted productivity of an engineer, so it would be like 30x, 300x, and I made these memes, and you could see my commit log building up. I'd be doing so many more commits than I would have if I was just solo developing before for these AI tools. Like literally, I'd say I'm at least a 10x to 20x committer, like more commits with these tools, more lines of code changed since. And that's like obvious, you can see that from my GitHub repository, I became top 2% of committers in GitHub this year, 2024. Commits alone are not enough to judge developer productivity. People suggested other metrics like story points, planning poker, and all of this. There's a whole science and career around estimating software developer productivity. There's whole jobs, product managers, and that's kind of what software developers are becoming more of as this ecosystem expands. Anyway, manually trying to manage all these AI coding instances proved to take a lot of time, and there was no way I could scale to 100X doing this. So I needed more autonomy. I needed some kind of way to manage all these AI agent tools autonomously. And that's when I decided to build my own tool. So around day 70, I started investigating and building my own tool. Now there's one key feature that I developed that I didn't see any of the other tools having. And that is the ability to spawn one to many agents all working on the exact same task. Now interestingly with these LLMs, even given the same input and context, they can produce different outputs. And this is very beneficial in our case because that means that they can traverse and look through the solution space, take different paths to a solution, providing different unique solutions. And that's what my tool does. Here's a little demo. So it's called the 100X Orchestrator. So here's the architecture. It's a Python app using the Flask framework because I thought a web interface would be the easiest to use over a CLI when managing many, many agents, many configurations and stuff like that. So here's how it works. This is the main screen here. So currently it works off a GitHub repository. You put in the repository URL, your access token, and then you can actually load every single github issue that exists in that repository and choose which one you want the agents to work on you specify how many agents you want to work on the task and you just press create agents. And what this will do is this will actually clone the repository into separate folders, one for each agent, make a branch in Git for each agent so they can all work on the same task or different tasks simultaneously without conflicting over the same files. So each agent is running an instance of Ader and looping with an LLM to instruct the Ader to do what it needs to do to get the task done. And this continues looping until the agent determines that it's finished Finished, and once it's finished, it will submit a pull request into the repository where a human can look over and accept or reject it. This is how it currently works. In the future, I want these agents to collaborate or the orchestrator to be able to take the best parts of each agent and combine them or give feedback to the agents to kind of steer it into the best direction. But currently this hasn't been implemented. And yeah, this is kind of where I left it off. In day 100, we have just this basic demo that I showed you. There's obviously a lot further we can take this, having more collaboration functionality, having the agents talk to each other, which currently doesn't exist. I think it's a great start. I haven't seen this branching of separate agents to work on the same task in any of the other tools that I've seen. And I think it actually will help discover new solutions 